I'm actually, like, really nervous right now. Because I don't know... Like, I took a big gamble on this, so I'm kind of worried how it's actually going to turn out. So, first thing I'm going to do is... I'm going to start with the stacks of 600 catalysts. So I'm going to do the abrasive catalyst first, and then we're going to see what comes out of it. I spent somewhere upwards of 1200, 1300, 1400 chaos on this selection here. So I'm hoping to get something back from it. So let's start with the abrasives. I'm actually, like, really nervous right now, because I don't know... Like, I took a big gamble on this, so I'm kind of worried how it's actually going to turn out. We've gotten 13 Fertile, 13 Prismatic, or unstable and one accelerating. The fertile I've found that you can very easily sell them for nine chaos a piece. So that's 117 plus another four times 28, which would be 112 plus three for the accelerating catalyst, and then 13 times 18, 234 plus 232. So we made. 476 chaos off of the 600 abrasives and let's assume that i bought them for two to a chaos so half a chaos each uh, i generally got a better deal than that closer to two and a half or three so i would have put in 300 at the absolute max close to 200 chaos let's subtract 250 just to be like really super conservative about this so we made a div off of those 600 right there Let's do the 600 tempering next. Oh, what of this prismatic? Or not prismatic. Imbued. That's the one I'm looking for. I always watch to make sure that there aren't any scraps. And... No, no one wants to destroy catalysts. Okay, so from that 600, 600 tempering, which usually are a little bit more, but uh, I managed to find a decent deal on them. So we got 476 chaos from turning in all 600 of those tempering catalysts. And going back to it again, I probably spent about 250 on that. 250, 300 chaos at maximum. So I'll just... They got 250, so we made a tiny, tiny bit more than last time, but still about a div off that. Now we're going to do the 1800 engine. We have three times the number of intrinsic that we did of the other two, so I'm hoping to get three dip profit. That would be ideal. Anything that comes out that's not one of these four is going right back into the Merc Bell tab. Okay, and that finishes us off. So we managed to make 11 unstables, 38 prismatics, 38 fertiles, and 20 accelerating. What about our handy dandy calculator? So out of 1800 intrinsic catalysts, we managed to get close to 1400 chaos back. We're gonna say that I put in about 800 chaos to get this, which is a bit under probably what I paid, because I usually bought things around two and a half or three to a chaos, but we're going to just be very conservative about this. So that's another 
600 chaos profit there, which is almost three div on its, on its own. If you add that to the uh, first two, which were, I believe, 216 and... It just occurred to me that I'm trying to do... I'm trying to do some math here that I really don't need to do. Because I can just do the final math using the actual catalyst instead of just guessing. <laughs> 560 for the unstables. Oh, we have so many prismatics. 64 prismatic catalysts. It's 1152 on its own. Plus the 560. We have 58 per tile. 58 per tile times 9 chaos apiece. 522. And then plus 66. So that's how much we grossed right there. Is almost exactly 10 divine. And then minus the original 1200. We have 1100 chaos profit. Divide that into the current cost of divines. 4.7 divine. Just by converting stuff. And I'm not going to say it didn't take a while for me to find people to actually sell the catalyst to me, but, you know. Oh, that is really nice to see. Well, I guess we're going to... It's going to be crashing the market later. <laughs>